Hello YouTubes, hello Ray, future Ray, uh, uh, still doing this? Yes, I am. Um, I haven't vlogged lately because of a lot of things going on, um, and but then I realized like if I'm vlogging, I should be showing you guys everything and not just like the good stuff that happens or the fun stuff that happens, and I should be showing you guys all the crappy stuff that also happens. So what's been happening is um, I've been having to uh, deal with a lot of, I guess I guess you could call it legal issues um, regarding tenants and, um, and like tenants and landlord agreements and stuff. So we we have our own we have our own house, uh, but we also have another house where we could just um, rent out to people. And this tenant that we have on the first floor of the other house um, hasn't been paying rent at all. We'll just call him A for now. Um, a stands for ass. Um, but yeah, he hasn't been paying rent and we're trying to really just kick him out basically, like evict him, but it's taking so much time because... Um, so we met with the lawyer and um, what the lawyer did and basically we went to court also so what the lawyer did was um, send him, I guess, uh, warning letters or or those notices telling them to pay rent on time. And so the first time we went to court, um, A said that he's going to pay rent. So so the judge, I guess, um, basically said yes to the agreement and said, okay, so A would pay rent and you guys will be fine. So a month later, he he said that he's going to pay. So he paid, say like the one thousand. He only paid like four hundred of it, and then he stopped paying again. Um, so basically, w w what we're doing here is we're pretty much stuck in limbo, um, not knowing what to do because he agrees to pay. He's he's not not he's like it's not like he's not paying. It's like he's paying small amounts, and he's dragging time and then basically his credit or, or like his his balance is building up and whereas we're trying to just collect you know i mean like it's business right you want to collect money that's why you rent your place to someone because you believe this tenant can pay his his or her rent on time um but in this case he's he is paying rent but he's not paying the full amount every every month and it's just really frustrating. It's crazy because it's not like we could just kick him out now because the judge knows that he is trying to pay rent. So we don't have really, we don't really have a say of like whether or not we can kick them out or not. I mean, I really, really, really just want them to want to kick them out so bad because it's been so we bought this house um, a year ago basically in August, I think, or no, in September. So September, October, November, December, January. It's been five months, and at January is when we finally resolved to um, looking for a lawyer, an attorney to help us. Um, and then so, because the lawyer is involved, there's not much, between January and um, March, I think, or April, we weren't able to collect any rent because I don't know why, I don't really know law at all. Um, so if you guys know law, please help me out. Um, but basically, Within those months of going to, to court and, and and trying to sort all these things out, we weren't able to collect any any rent for for those three months. Okay, so the, the, so that's gone. We still haven't fully collected all the rent from the first five months, and right now this whole cycle continues again and repeats and, and continues and repeats. And it's just so frustrating because I just want this to be over with. I mean, like, I'm so pissed right now like I you have no idea how mad I am I just today was just like one of those shitty days where nothing could cheer you up like nothing like it's one of those days where you're just so fed up with all this crap and and right now A isn't even returning our calls he isn't returning he isn't answering his texts we've been texting him calling him to tell him to to pay the rent we're trying to reach him but he's not he's like a no-show we drove to to the house to to collect the money um like we told him ahead of time we told him we're gonna we're gonna go on the 23rd so it was actually monday yesterday um we told we told him that 23rd is when we're gonna come and pick up the money 
they went, I mean, we went and they weren't there. I texted them last night um, until this morning, afternoon, and right now it is almost 8 o'clock and they haven't responded. So we don't know what to do. Um, and I don't think our lawyer is actually doing his job because we just want to evict him. We just want to get this tenant out and just find new ten tenants and and quickly just resolve and hopefully like finding new tenants would be quick and then um, basically restoring what we what we didn't weren't able to collect. So as of now, I think we should just look for a different lawyer. Um, hopefully, one that's more competent in solving cases like this. Um, it's just so grueling because. Um, because when I was in school, right now I graduated, but then when I was in school, my parents had to be dealing with this. Um, like every night or, or every other night, they would have to drive over there because the tenants like, okay, you come over and pick up, pick up the check now. So we go over there and they're like, you know what? We don't really have the money. Can you come like tomorrow night? So it's like almost every night we have to drive to, to the house and then quote unquote, try to collect the money, which they never have. So right now I'm just so pissed at them. There's no word to describe how how infuriated I am right now. I'm just so freaking pissed and like I've never been this pissed in my life. This whole scenario, there is no reason why he is not paying the rent and he's and this person, this tenant A, he insists that we give them money to renovate their kitchen, their and basically re uh, redecorate the whole the whole apartment. We're like no, because there is no reason why we have to do that because you haven't even paid your rent. So why are you telling us that we need to help you guys redecorate your, your house? We don't, number one, we don't have the money because you haven't been paying rent. And number two, we have mortgages to, to, um, to pay off also. So right now we have two mortgages to pay off, a payoff and we need, basically we need that rent to cover the mortgage and you're not helping us either. So. I can't imagine why you're even asking us to give you any money to redecorate or renovate. It's, that pissed me off even more. Um, so I mean, I've never met anyone so obnoxious and so so ridiculous in in what they do. It's like, are you even human? Like a, a decent human being would be able to apologize and and try to resolve everything. I mean, we're we're decent people here. We're not like tr we're not forcing you to pay. We're, we're it's it's a it's a deal. You you rent a place. You you live in a home. You have if you if you bought the home, the, the house, then great. Then you get to live there and not have to worry about rent. But then if you rent a place, you have to pay the rent. And it's basically a business. This is this is how rent works everywhere in the world. And I don't see why you're an exception. That you have to you you get like a leeway or or like a, a like a freaking long grace period just so you don't have to pay rent on time. I mean like everyone pays rent on time, everyone tries to pay rent on time and you're not trying hard at all and it's just so furious. And I'm sorry I'm not talking to you guys as if you are the tenant, I'm just talking to the camera because it's so frustrating and hopefully I'm just basically hoping that my tenant watches this and and knows that he's a freaking ass. It's like one of those shitty days where you just, where nothing can cheer you up. Um, yeah, so. That's why I haven't vlogged. And on a brighter note, I'm meeting with my friend Ketsia and Anthony on Thursday um, for a quick dinner before I fly. Um, yeah, I'm going to Vancouver, so that's like the only thing that's that I'm looking forward to. I saw Waz Wally's um, vlog, and I really want to try that method. Um, it's basically like a water bottle and soap and like some some sugar in a bottle and you could capture a wasp and I'm gonna try it hopefully tomorrow. Although I, we don't we don't really get wasps here, hopefully like his method or their method would be able to capture other types of bugs too who likes sweet stuff um, and could die drinking soap. But yeah. So thanks for watching. I mean it's not like a typical vlog where everything is just happy happy happy. I'm still really pissed. So yeah, if you guys know any way for me to get this tenant out, please let me know in the comment box below. And thanks for watching. Sorry it's not like a happy vlog, but I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.